I'm on my second iLive project here. Uh, headphones are cooking, getting charged up. So I'm not wearing those today. But this is my second iLive project, which is basically what I did was, well, I'll show you here. Okay, so what that is is a iLive and it's got a passive subwoofer and some uh, rods there which that's like an act like a tweeter a passive tweeter and on the top there is a glass horn okay that's a glass horn right there let to see if I can get a picture right down the throat of it there. Yeah, that's a little bit of fiberglass down in there. Okay. So that is the eye live, and you can see that little white dot. That's a subwoofer. <coughs> so you can see it's pretty glowing. The wood there, you can see it's <clears throat> mounted into some wood which is that wood is uh, made of walnut okay it's pretty good and it sounds good I hear tones coming off of that uh, that you know that it's just extremely uh, things that you just don't really pick up you know with other you know that because there's any other I don't have anything else as a glass horn the glass horn just picks up the, you know it reproduces the piano very very nicely um, also orchestrated uh, pieces you can hear um, the orchestration with uh, you know violins, cellos, tropical instruments like uh, xylophone, melodic drums are very very clear uh, and uh, Brahms uh, sounds really good on this uh, So, so this is the iLive project number two. And I'll just see if I can. I think I'll plug it in here. See if I can get it to play something. I'll set it right there. I'll set it right next to the camera, next to the can, and get some music on. Here we go. Play some flute music here.
so with this eyeliner project, I showed you quite a bit, but I didn't really show you everything that I did to it, um, because simply the idea is really not to copy what I did, but, you know, just to give you the idea that, uh, it's not all a bad little project to have fun with, and don't copy me, just do it your own way, because you might come up with something that's better, but I really like this glass horn, I really do, but I think there are maybe, you know, if you decided to, you know, do something like this, try some crystal, try some different shapes or whatever, um, I had a, a, a bulb on top of there, I was like, a sphere, a glass sphere. That sounded pretty good too. It doesn't sound as good as this, as this bell shape. You know, I, I don't think it does. It sounded pretty good. This slightly different texture to this glass and different thickness and uh, uh, I think it sounds a little better. And the keys, the piano keys really chime in really good. It's like you know, they sound really super clear uh, with this glass horn. I like it, and I'm enjoying this eye live, so, which I didn't really pay very much for, because um, they're cheap. You know, they're really cheap, so. That music was re-recorded with a really super cheap cam microphone. And uh, it sounds like it has a lot of clarity. Um, just, just beautiful tones coming from that glass horn there. Okay, so this was the totally unsponsored project. And I did it because, for two reasons. Um, uh, I was bored and it didn't cost very much. So, but I got something really good out of it. I hope you do too, so. Yeah. Ciao for now, right?